All right, we're with head coach Mark Burson, uh, team getting ready to train here on a beautiful Wednesday afternoon here at the practice fields in Columbia, South Carolina. Coach, um, Clemson come to town Friday night, huge match. Uh, hope to see a lot of fans out there, uh, 7 p.m. kickoff. Uh, your thoughts heading into it? Yeah, I think, uh, first of all, I think we have a chance to break the attendance record uh, on Friday night, which would be something to shoot for. Um, I, uh, we've got a lot of students in town, big weekend for home football and the opener, and uh, Clemson on Friday night doesn't get much better than that for a student at the University of South Carolina, so I hope we can have a good crowd out there. Um, you know, as far as uh, the match, you know, it's always a big match. It's always uh, two good teams. Uh, you know, it's a little bit early, so, you know, both teams are still clearly trying to define themselves a little bit and see what they're all about. But, um, you know, one thing you'll see is a massive effort on both teams' uh, parts on, uh, on Friday night. You've been a part of this match for a long time. Um, you guys play them every year, sometimes multiple times a year if you play them in the NCAA tournament. Um, just what overall does this match mean to you and what does it mean to college soccer? Well, I think first of all, you know, you, you have to give credit, you know, Clemson's uh, always a worthy opponent, you know, in, in all sports. So it's going to bring out the best in the teams that, that we play, and, and that's, an, that's an important factor. The second thing is, you know, it's an in-state rivalry, you know, it's a, it's a match that we, you know, uh, think about all year long, and you live with the result all year long, so that's important for all of us. And the last thing I would say is, you know, uh, it's a quality team and an important team as far as the NCAA. RPI and everything else going forward so you know in all categories uh, it checks all the boxes for a big big game for us what do you guys need to do to be successful Friday night and come out with a W well I think the first thing is we need to be you know good defensively we need to make sure that we limit our mistakes and that we pounce on theirs generally speaking in big games rivalry games things don't always go according to plan and it comes down to you know your ability to capitalize on the mistakes that the opponent makes and your ability to cut down on your own mistakes and you know uh, it's it's a crazy game there's a lot of emotion uh, you know you just can't really draw it up how it's going to go because of all the factors involved but clearly you know that's going to be a big factor is our ability to capitalize on on opportunities that we get in the match uh, lastly um, last time you guys played them here two years ago you guys broke the single game stone stadium attendance record I believe 6,892 fans at the match it was crazy packed um, any any message for the fans well, I know this. It's kind of exciting to be a part of something. It's kind of exciting to be a part of something big. So my message would be, you know, where would you want to be when the record was broken? They can be in the stands. They can be earning double points for the Georgia football tickets, and they can be cheering us on against our arch rival. I mean, what a great way to spend a Friday night, and I hope everybody will seize on that opportunity as our Carolina students and then, gosh, in the community. I mean, I've already had so many calls for people trying to get tickets and trying to get into the stadium, so I think it'll be a great evening. Okay, thanks, Coach. Appreciate the time. Best of luck for everyone. Thanks.